guys want to see my video? Hey everyone, welcome back to another video. Today I'm up here at St. Mary's Glacier in Colorado here. It's kind of windy out, it's about 18 degrees Fahrenheit, so it's pretty cold. I got, I didn't come prepared, I have my uh, gloves with holes in them and everything, but also I apologize for the camera moving around, but the reason I came up here today is to review a couple products, a couple outdoor products, especially for winter weather. How uh, we have some, here we have the Unigear crampons. These are the uh, trail runner size. They also have hiking boots, trail runners, and something else. I forget. I'll put it right here for you. And also I have some waterproof gaiters here to keep my feet and legs dry and warm. So I'm wearing trail runners. Alright, so first we want to put these gaiters on. They're pretty simple. So these gaiters are pretty great. They're completely waterproof. They have a zipper and Velcro that goes all the way up. So I'm just gonna demonstrate how to put them on in case you're wondering how. So these are Fall Raven Vita Pros right here and they actually have a gaiter already in them. So I'm gonna go ahead and hook up already with my little hook built into the pants. Then with the gaiters, you just wrap them around them up. These gators come in a few different sizes, small, medium, large, and extra large. Then we're going to Velcro it up, just like that. And then you bring them down to your sneaker or your hiking boot or whatever, and you hook them into the lace just like that. Then this strap here goes around the bottom. and it hooks into this little loop right here. Just like that. At the top there's this elastic band, you just pull it tight, snug it up, and then you're done. Next we have these crampons here. They come in this little bag. By the way, this stuff is really affordable too. They're not the best quality in the world, but for what I'm doing, this is perfect. So, these are also really simple to install. Just open the Velcro, pop your foot in like this. I'm gonna sit down for this. You loop the back around the back of your shoe. It's gotta even everything up, make sure everything is lined up correctly. Yeah. <laughs> All right, then you just gotta make sure everything's kinda of even on your foot. All those spikes are coming out of the bottom. This Velcro strap goes right through here and right back over the top. There we go. So I'll do the same thing for the other foot and we can uh, safely hike up this hill here. Well, they're working really good so far. As you can see, this trail is just all packed snow. It's like that all the way up. Okay, so as you can see right behind me here, this is all deeper snow. I wanna, uh, I'm gonna walk up that with these crampons and gaiters on and see if uh, see if I lose them or if my legs get wet or anything. I'm only wearing trail runner shoes, sneakers, so my feet are probably gonna get wet, but I just wanna see how the crampons hold up.
Yeah. Is that a parking spot? Yeah. 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 Up this way or that way? Up this way. Right? Yeah. You're almost there. Well, that wasn't too bad. Uh, I, it's actually kind of hard packed and I was able to run down it and didn't even have to worry about slipping or falling. Pretty good so far. So as you may be able to tell, it's a little blustery out today. Holy cow. It's all right, we're almost here. It's not a very far hike. Oh, check it out. So this is pure ice right here. I have no fear of falling down this. I'm on like a slope right there. I wouldn't think about doing that in my regular shoes. There's a few people out here. Enjoying the day. But yeah, it's really cool up here. Wind's blowing me back. <laughs> Look how this tree is just twisted up. So we're gonna go over here by the lake. And actually, I don't think the glacier itself is even accessible right now. All right, so this part of the video, um, the wind was so bad that you actually aren't able to hear what I'm saying. Right up there where I pointed, that's where the glacier actually is. There was no way to actually get over there. So at this point, I'm kind of just like looking at the lake, seeing that it's frozen. And here's where I decide to go ahead and just start running around on the lake. Just to test out these crampons. And you'll see here in a second that uh, it's kind of like the... Um, Uncle Rico part of Napoleon Dynamite where he's playing football recording himself so I stopped doing that pretty quickly. Alright, I'm gonna go out and play on the ice for a little bit. Let's see how it works out. Hey, you guys wanna see my video? Too much of Napoleon Dynamite when Uncle Rico was making his football movie. Enough of that. St. Mary's Glacier here in Colorado. First day of December. Not too bad. All right, well, my outro in the video out there at St. Mary's Glacier. It was so windy you couldn't even hear what I was saying, so I'm just gonna film one for you. I just wanted to say thanks for watching. If you guys are interested in those crampons from Unigear or the gators from Unigear, links in the description as always. They're Amazon links. If you click on it, I actually get a little percentage of it. It's not much or anything, but um, I think they're really good, especially if you're into the kind of stuff I'm into. They're actually really good if you want to climb like that packed snow and everything. Even on ice, they're really good. So anyway, if you guys liked the video, make sure you hit the thumbs up button. If you haven't subscribed yet, go ahead and do that. I put out a new video every three days. That's all I got for today. Thanks for watching.